Ciao ragazza! Come stai? Stai benissimo! Hi Manny! Thank you for the invitation! It is really so fun to see you again! Sunny! Cooking time! Hi Mortacci! C'è così tardi! Allora ragazza! I need to leave! Thank you so much! It was really very very nice to talk with you again! Ciao ragazza! Bye mommy! Bye bye Ellie! Che lo che un ma! Are we ready? Certamente! Um, what? What's that? What? Yeah, this bling bling! Oh, that! Oh, that's just a small Rolex! You know, there are guys, they got it, and some not! Alright, then you're the guy who got this! Oh, thank you, you're really kind! Um, and what's that? A glass of wine? Really? <sighs> anyway, I first need to take off my bling bling! So, my Rolex! Yeah, which is fake! You just know as much about it as the man in the moon! All right! Ready to start the show! Cool! Looks great! So let's start! Hi there and welcome to my today's show! Spaghetti Squash Bolognese! Really a fantastic paleo dish and I'm thrilled to present it to you! While we are going to prepare the wedges, put back the meat into the fridge! I need some spice here! Alright, let's come to the spaghetti squash! To make your work easier, cut away both endings. First, cut it into half. <laughs> then you can scarp out the seeds. If you want, you can put it aside and roast them later. Cool, huh? Now grease the halves with some olive oil. You can use your paw, therefore, or a brush as you want. And then you can season it with some salt and hapa. That's it! Now you can already put them upside down on your baking tray. Put them into the oven for around 35 to 45 minutes by 180 degrees or 360 Fahrenheit. And while the spaghetti squash is baking, you got time to focus on the other ingredients. Chop the garlic. Chop the onion. Roughly, just like that. Peel the carrots. Now cut the carrots into stripes. And finally, cut them into cubes. I recommend that you put the garlic, onion and the carrots into a separate bowl. Prepare the natural tomato puree. Hmm, shall I tell you how it looks like? No. Okay, finally chop the pepper bell. Hmm, let me once again fix the sequence. Olive oil, carrots and stuff. Tomato puree. Spices, meat, bell pepper, two canned tomatoes. Oh, my spaghetti squash is already finished! Just scarp it out the long way downside. Okay, back to the bolognese. Gently fry the onion, garlic, carrots, glazzy. Then add the ground meat. Yummy! Spice it with some salt, pepper and paprika. As soon the meat changed the color into grey-brown, add the tomato puree. Mmm, stir it around. And after around 3 to 5 minutes, add the pepper bell. After again around 5 minutes, finally add the canned tomato. Finally drink or deglease some wine with it. This will provide a great taste to the bolognese. Alright, after around 15 minutes to 3 hours, the sauce is ready and you can serve the dish. As a design thing, you can add the spaghetti squash bolognese again back to the skin of the squash. <laughs> I know. It looks fantastic, right? Welcome back, Ellie! I thank you for the invitation! You're welcome! Eat nicely, money! Eat nicely! Oh my god, come on! What? Do you still know the case with the tomato puree? Uh, yes. Do you know how this looks like? I can imagine what you think. Oh yeah? Ha ha! <laughs> I not even tell it! 
I just illustrated. <laughs> See, no words, and anyway, all is clear. Oh my gee, you are a genius. Okay, guys, that's it with my today's show. I'm looking forward to see you again next week. And don't forget, be hot, stay cool. <laughs> <laughs>